Hey YouTube, I'm gonna make a quick video of uh, this thermometer, non-contact or ear thermometer I got on Amazon, um, model EFT-161. Um, yeah, just uh, I'll show, I'll give you uh, some some screenshots of this um, manual here in case you don't have it. But one thing I was noticing, it's a good thermometer, but um, I was struggling because when I replaced the batteries, how do you change the units from Celsius to Fahrenheit? So I changed them to Fahrenheit, but uh, say it was at Celsius and I needed to, ch needed to change it back. All right, so what you need to do is you need to let this thing pretty much completely boot down or just hold in uh, hold in the memory button for a couple seconds and it'll shut off all right so with it off hold down the memory button for six seconds and then this screen's going to show up with degrees fahrenheit blinking press I missed it. Hold this uh, memory button to turn it off again. Hold it for six seconds. Tap it once, degrees Celsius. Again, degrees Fahrenheit, vice versa. And then just let it um, turn off normally. And then when you start it up, it's now in degrees Celsius. Now if I wanted to change that back to Fahrenheit, from it off, six seconds on the memory button, tap it once to degrees Fahrenheit, let it turn off by itself. Now you're on degrees Fahrenheit. Just uh, also a note on this thing, um, right now this is set up for a forehead measurement. If you want to do a ear measurement, it'll automatically um, tell you, hey, we're for an ear right now with that little symbol, and it uses a little switch to say, okay, now it's for a forehead when that's depressed versus an ear when it's not. The temperature difference between the two I'll show you, you know, 89.4, and then with it depressed, 95.9. So it has some internal calibration between the two measurements. So, um, so that's kind of cool. Um, and I do just want to give you the opportunity to kind of look at this manual here. In case you lost yours, you can pause the video on any of these screens to kind of take a look at it. Yeah, here's here's uh, the verbiage to change the um, units on it. It wasn't very clearly written, so hopefully this video was helpful in that regard. All right. Thanks for watching. I hope this was helpful. Um, give you the back of this on the serial number or the model number two. So yeah, hopefully you found this helpful and uh, it's pretty easy to change the temperature measurement on this non-contact thermometer for both foreheads and ears. Um, if you can find one on Amazon, um, yeah, they're not too bad. So thanks.